Hi guys, welcome back. Beautifully Belly here with another video. I'm not gonna tell y'all that I was just recording a video for y'all. It was a deer outside. I picked this up to show y'all and my, my dang thing cut off, so now I gotta start over. All right, anyway, um, good morning everyone. It is uh, 10.06 a.m. I've been up since eight something. My husband um, woke me up this morning like he does every morning. He used to be really, really quiet like a ninja. He would get out the bed. I wouldn't hear anything, wouldn't feel anything. But now he's up, walking around, going to the bathroom, turning his game on, phone ringing, just getting his medicine, all that. Right, so I had to tell him this morning, like, good morning, baby, I love you, but I'm gonna need you to stop waking me up in the morning, okay? I need to get up on my own, all right? It won't be no longer than um, nine o'clock. Sorry, that's my husband texting me. He's not here, so y'all know my phone gotta go on loud. Um, yeah, he's up, he's walking around, he's doing all this stuff, he's opening the blinds and stuff, and then you know, now I'm up and it's like, I'm gonna need you to stop doing that, please. Um, yeah, the walking around and, and the feeling like you standing over me because we have one night stand in our room and it's on my side, biggest mistake ever. Um, <laughs> everything of his goes on my side, um, but I'm gonna get him a little because it's our 17th anniversary coming up. We supposed to buy each other a piece of furniture. So, I already know what I'm getting him. He already know. It's gonna be like a little mini fridge, but not mini, but a bigger one. And um, it's gonna go on his side. It's just gonna be like a beverage station because he likes pineapples at night. And um, I wanna have beverages cold for him. I do keep water in the room, but you know his other little stuff. So, I'm gonna get him that. My son's birthday is coming up, um, October 8th. He will be 25. So I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do about that. Um, I know what I'm doing with my hair. I didn't tell y'all. I figured it out. I did get the ball in motion when I went to get my hair done last. So it'll be a change next time. I think next time I go is November 27th. Um... But yeah, I'm gonna just get on here and my hair is gonna be different. So I'm happy about that. Y'all know today is the first of the month. So I did pay all the bills already, every single one, except for my pay later bills. Um, what else? Oh, I got therapy tomorrow. I, I do keep a notebook. This is my therapy notebook. And I just write stuff I want to talk about in therapy so I'm not wasting my time and my money um it's important for me to get it out however that is whether it be through recording or going to therapy or working on it outside of therapy which I do do a lot like say I'm having an issue or something comes up for me I'll talk about it in therapy and I'll finish processing outside of therapy um I do talk about a lot of stuff in therapy, but I don't talk about everything. I'm just not there yet. But yeah, I do have therapy tomorrow. So we'll see how that goes because that's that's a mood changer. It could be either good or bad. Um, so I gotta see how I feel tomorrow. It's always like that. And what else? Um, oh yeah, ladies and gentlemen, I'm not gonna make this video long. If you stay home, if you're a stay-at-home spouse, um, I guess, boyfriend, girlfriend, I don't know, baby mom, baby dad, I don't know. But if you stay at home, you live with your partner, and you stay at home, make sure you're doing what you're supposed to do. Don't just be in the house watching TV, chilling and playing. Make sure that house is clean, laundry done, bed is changed. Food is cooked, kids are tended to. Make sure y'all doing what y'all supposed to do because the other party is out doing what they're supposed to do. And you don't wanna feel like you're being taken for granted and they don't wanna feel like they're being taken for granted. So do your part. All right guys, that's all I got. Um, 
I'm not, I don't know. I didn't cook breakfast just, I didn't cook breakfast yesterday. Clearly I cooked breakfast yesterday. I'm not cooking breakfast today because Kwani didn't ask me to. Naya's already at work. She's been there since 5.45 this morning. Um, I didn't cook dinner last night. That's what I was trying to say. My husband ended up ordering Indian food because I ordered Indian food for him the day before, but it got canceled because it was too late. Um, so he ordered it yesterday. I mean, again, the butter chicken I made, it was good. It tastes like butter chicken. It just, it wasn't spicy. And I, I like, I like spice though. All right, guys, that's all I got for real this time. Um, I might jump back on later. We'll see. But if nobody told you that you're enough today, you are enough just the way you are with no strings attached. And if nobody told you that they love you today, I love you. So until next time, guys, peace, love, and blessings. To the next one.